You're going up, and when you're going up, it's hard, but when you're going down, it's fast. So, my mom was born in 1967. I know, it seems like a long time ago. <laughs> but she had two great parents. Um, if you guys don't know, Jean and Brian right there, great people. Um, and like, I think two years later, she had a sister, Shannon, who didn't even show up tonight. <laughs> Her, her daughter did have to get her appendix taken out, but no excuses. Um, so anyway, she's having a rough time, but two years, another two years later, another sister, and even worse than the one before. Um, so, I just got my speeches She was having a great time, turned two years old, and then starting to go down. And she started to work hard. Got good grades in high school. Went away to uh, two? Went away to hell. <laughs> no, no, no. Right. She went, she raised above the fact that she had two terrible sisters. <laughs> Absolutely terrible. The worst. And um, she raised above, worked hard, got good grades at JDSSS, which, if anyone doesn't know, it's a great school. Send your kids there. There's no crystal meth problem. It's awesome. Um, so anyway, she went to both. And then, honestly, the worst thing possible happened. She went to a Durham Thundercats hockey game. Thundercats! And somehow she met Rob Reed. And I, I'm sure a lot of you guys here are married and you have super romantic stories. My dad proposed to my mom in a Durham Thundercats beer garden. He said yes, <laughs> so anyway, if we're, if we're talking about highs and lows, she's low. Oh. Two years later, she has BJ. And you don't think you can get lower? You can go But um, anyway, it got better. 11 months, one year, 11 days later, she had me. And that's when it started going back up again. She said, you know what? It's all right. My life I, th is I think I have purpose. <laughs> um, so anyway, and then it brought her to here, where uh, most of you guys have known her for a long time, and she's actually a pretty good person. Um, and I know most of you guys look at her and say, wow, I envy her. Every day, living with Rob Reed and her two sons that are actually very similar to Rob. <laughs> I wish I had that life. <laughs> but she puts up with a lot of she, she puts up with a lot of shit. Um, most days like BJ will get BJ will get going or I will get going and like we'll get mom mad. And it's literally if I'm getting my mom mad, the other two scurry up the stairs and we just start chirping her and we get her so mad. And I know you guys wish you had that life, but she, she puts up with a lot of stuff. But um, now, because I don't want to make everything about my mom, like she's throwing this big, like envious, she's throwing this big envious party. Like everyone, give me attention. I'm turning red. But anyway, so my mom had a pretty bad childhood, pretty bad life. <laughs> At least she had one good kid, but my mom was actually a pretty cool mom. Um, so for those of you who don't know, my dad played for the Durham Thundercats. And anyone who plays for the Durham Thundercats, most of you guys have hot wives. And I was a little... go to the games and I wouldn't sit in my mom's lap, she would pass me around to the other good looking mom. It's like, oh, I didn't appreciate it at the time. It was like, now I look back, it's like, right on, Kelly. Right on. Oh, wow. And then um, in grade one, my, I had my mom as a teacher and I had a crush on three girls. And lo and behold, every time we would go into group projects, these three girls were in my group. So again, right on Kelly. 
I was hanging up with the best moms, the prettiest girls in my class. Awesome. Did you want to turn? No, I'm good. So, so sure. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. So anyway, my my mom was pretty cool. Um, was. But I remember the day that she came up to me and said, Garrett, you are my favorite child. <laughs> Nothing will ever change that. I love you more than anything. But I remember there was a contest. It was close to Mother's Day, and you had to submit a poem. And I was in grade one, and I wrote my mom a poem. I wrote it, and I completely forgot about it. And she came home crying one day. And she had a rose in her hand. And she's like, did you write this? I said, yeah, I think so. <laughs> um, but anyway, and I was super proud of myself. And as we, were, as we were planning this party, I was trying to remember what I wrote. Um, I can't remember it. So. <laughs> well, that's a good story. So um, I recreated the poem from what I can remember. And then I tried to rhyme words. So the way I think it went was... To most people, my mom is a witch. <laughs> if you see her at home, she is a bit of a... Oh! Bitch. But if you see the side that I see, you will realize she is kind to me. I love my mom more than anything. <laughs> that rhyme and do with that one. And again, this is great one, so I couldn't think of a word to rhyme. My mom is pretty awesome. And that's how the whole thing is. Oh, he is so you. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, I'll say. I'll say. <laughs> 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 <laughs>